Hello and welcome, my name is Pankaj Dubey and uh, in this video we are going to talk about non-functional testing types. So uh, I mean checking the behavior, security, performance and uh, there are many other things which will be covered as part of the non-functional testing. So let's begin with the performance testing. So what is performance testing? Performance testing is a test done to determine how a system performs in terms of speed, load and stability under a particular workload. Perform to check the reliability of the application and the performance, performance testing types are load testing, stress testing and soak testing. So what is load testing? Load testing is done to determine how the application behaves under a specific load. So there are some st uh, scenarios where you will be asked to check that if 10 concurrent users try to access the same API then see that how what is the response to your website or web application so this sort of testing will be performed as part of the load testing stress testing also you have to make sure that you have to make a note that what is the breakpoint of your application okay so this testing is performed to check the breakpoint of the application so that the team can plan for load balancer i mean if your application is crashing when 1000 users ca come to your website so this has to be sure uh, before 1000 actual users uh, traffic comes on your website so this is how you can plan for the load balancer so that you can transfer the further traffic on any other web server so this is why stress testing is required soak testing soak testing is done to check that how the application behaves when the app gone through under a specific load for a specific time now security testing security testing is testing process intended to flaws in the security mechanisms of an application to protect data sensitivity information sensitive information this testing is done to check the vulnerabilities in the application to ensure that the sensitive data travels in encrypted format to ensure that no unauthorized access can be made for this thing you better uh, explore it on website the search for OWASP security models and OWASP 10 uh, top 10 security threats so that you can get a better idea of security testing and also OWASP is a tool that is a required uh, to do security testing and this is very essential in the market of security testing compatibility testing you have to make sure that your website application or the mobile application is compatible on different different devices on different different versions of the OS uh, so this is why the compatibility testing is required Compatibility testing is done to check the application's responsiveness across various OS, devices and browsers. So uh, you will check it on, suppose you have developed a website, you will check it on uh, Windows OS, Mac OS, you will check it on different different devices like the Android device, or like the iPhone device or any other device and then again on different different browsers like Chrome, Firefox and uh, the, the Internet Explorer and uh, safari and also you have to check that this is working on different versions of the browsers so if you are checking it for the chrome then you will have to check for the latest chrome version and also some previous versions of the chrome version so this is how you will be covering the compatibility testing and maintaining a maintaining a infrastructure or you can say a platform to perform the compatibility testing is like very costly because you won't be able to keep the, uh, the different different versions of the chrome like the version 47, version 48, 49 and same you won't be able to do it for the firefox or the, or the internet explorer so in that case what you will have to do you will have to take a cloud service to perform the compatibility testing if you want to cover the almost all uh, aspects of the, uh, the application's response this testing is done to check the application's rendering and usability on different different devices OS and browsers this testing is done to make sure that all target devices are covered. Compatibility testing uh, for this thing you can use cloud service to perform the compatibility testing like Saucy Labs or the browser stack or you can use the Google Chrome developer mode to check the responsiveness you can do it uh, by, by, the, uh, by this uh, Google Chrome this is really uh, Google Chrome developer mode is really very important and you can also optimize you can check why the page uh, load is very slow at uh, and I'll show you in a different uh, video uh, so you can use that too I am given here a screenshot of the browser stack here you can see that uh, there are different different 
मोबाइल वर्जन लाइक आई फोन फाइव एस गैलेक्सी एस फाइव मिनी गैलेक्सी एस फाइव गैलेक्सी नोट थ्री आई फोन आई पैड्स विंडोज मैक सो बाई पुटिंग अ सिंपल यू आर एल हेयर यू कैन चेक दैट हाउ योर एप्लीकेशन इज रेंटरिंग ऑन डिफरेंट डिफरेंट डिवाइस सो दिस इज वेरी यूजफुल इन वेन यू टॉक अबाउट कंपेटेबिलिटी टेस्टिंग सो थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग